Gusto mo ba? Sige na. The Republic Act 9165 or Comprehensive Dangerous Drugs Act of 2002 has been strictly enforced by the government since Rodrigo Roa Duterte, the former president, won the 2016 election. This policy is imposed by the government to deal with the state's problem with illegal drugs. You must have heard how many of our countrymen are destroyed by illicit drugs and how dangerous drugs take people's lives from school officials or frequently from government officials. The drugs are chemicals that affect the body and brain, with some having long-lasting effects and others permanent effects. If it is bad, then why is it addictive? When a person takes a drug, the brain releases a chemical called dopamine to create a high mood. The user also begins to lose the ability to resist these bad cravings, making it harder for him or her to quit. But when a person takes a drug repeatedly, the brain adopts the dopamine rush that occurs. Now, how does the law affect us, especially the youth? Teenagers still lack the maturity in discernment of how important it is to comply with their country's laws. According to statistics, there are over 190 million drug users worldwide and the problem is growing at an alarming rate, especially among young people under the age of 30. If this law isn't taken seriously in the long run, legal action is to be taken. This law doesn't allow plea bargaining and the worst case is probation law isn't allowed for those who violated this national law on illegal drugs. Be a good role model and stay drug for yourself. Help them understand the negative consequences of using drugs. Teach them ways to resist pressure to use drugs. Assess them with their life problems and make them feel that you are available for help and support. Always know and remember, we are all in this together.